Sarah Bartman was born in 1789 in the Eastern Cape region of South Africa. At the age of 16, she was approached by a Dutchman named Hendrik Caesars, who convinced her to travel with him to Europe, promising that she would earn money and enjoy a better life. However, upon arriving in Europe, Sarah was turned into a spectacle and treated inhumanely. Sarah was made to perform in circuses and freak shows, where she was exhibited as the Hottentot Venus. The Europeans marveled at her large hips, buttocks, and elongated labia, which they saw as the features of a typical savage African woman. They also made derogatory comments about her physique and sexuality. Despite the exploitation and abuse she suffered, Sarah was able to negotiate with her owners and earn some degree of freedom. She traveled around Europe, drawing large crowds of curious onlookers wherever she went. However, Sarah continued to face prejudice and marginalization, and her condition worsened as she became addicted to alcohol. In 1814, Sarah was sold to a Frenchman named Roe, who took her to France and exhibited her in Paris. She was studied by medical and scientific experts who used her as a basis to support their theories about the differences between Europeans and Africans. Sarah was forced to endure humiliating examinations, including having her genitalia exposed to the public. Sarah's condition deteriorated rapidly in France, and she fell ill with a variety of diseases. She died in 1815 at the age of 26. Her body was dissected, and her remains were displayed at the Museum of Natural History in Paris for more than a century. Sarah Bartman's story is a tragic example of the colonial exploitation of African women's bodies and exploitation. It has become a symbol of the countless atrocities committed against people of color throughout history and a reminder that we must never forget the inhumanity and injustices of our past.